One of the most horrifying disasters in Italian history, a flood that roared down from the Bayonne Dam and decimated a valley. Best estimates put the toll at 1,800 dead and thousands of others injured. So devastating was the wall of water that roared down the valley of the River Piave that entire villages were wiped from the map as if they never existed. Animation shows how a landslide plummeted into the man-made lake behind the dam and sent a great wave over the barrier. Within six minutes, the waters had spread terror, death, and destruction. For hours, additional rock falls spread fears that the dam itself might let go, the third highest dam in the world. However, the dam held as people far down the valley fled their homes. More than 80% of the population of Langaron died in the flood. There are few traces left of the once thriving villages. The roll is a long one. Pirago, Rivalta, towns that are no more. Men cry unashamedly. Ten thousand Italian troops are rushed to the scene to assist in rescue operations. But as one doctor said, it is a work of pity more than assistance. Villages have disappeared as if they never existed. There are so few survivors in some villages that identification of the dead is impossible. A common grave is their destiny. There were miracles in this arena of death. Some survivors were found alive after being buried as long as 60 hours. The United States rushed aid to the stricken area. Helicopters and bulldozers, portable hospitals and food, anything that could relieve the misery and suffering was put at the disposal of the Italian government. The heart of the world poured out to the suffering survivors. 1963 has been the year of natural calamities. Cyclones, hurricanes, eruptions and earthquakes have taken a toll of nearly 30,000 lives in a period of less than a year. The tenacity of man as he faces reverses is a fruit of the human spirit. With prayers for their dead, the people of the Piave Valley have turned to rebuilding their homes and their lives.